Welcome everyone from the desert, bringing you Desert Faith at DesertBedrock.com. Let's begin as we begin all things holy. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The following is an excerpt from the Divine Office, also known as the Liturgy of the Hours. The second reading that is taken from the Office of Readings. From a homily on Saint Agatha by Saint Methodius of Sicily. Bishop The gift of God the source of all goodness. My fellow Christians, our annual celebration of a martyr's feast has brought us together. She achieved renown in the early church for her noble victory. She is well known now as well, for she continues to triumph through her divine miracles, which occur daily and continue to bring glory to her name. She is indeed a virgin, for she was born of the Divine Word, God's only Son, who also experienced death for our sake. John, a master of God's word, speaks of this. He gave the power to become children of God to everyone who received him. Agatha, the name of our saint, means good. She was truly good, for she lived as a child of God. She was also given as the gift of God, the source of all goodness to her bridegroom, Christ and to us. For she grants us a share in her goodness. Agatha, her goodness coincides with her name and way of life. 
she won a good name by her noble deeds. And by her name, she points to the nobility of those deeds. Agatha, her mere name, wins all men over to her company. She teaches them by her example to hasten with her to the true good. God alone. From the desert with Desert Faith this message has been delivered to you individually and collectively. Each and every syllable, word, and sentence, all in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. In nomine Patris et Fili et Spiritus Sancti. Amen. <laughs>